Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another unboxing video from the Gamer Shack. It's Arcade Block time. Arcade Block is a monthly subscription box from the guys over at Nerdblock. It costs 22 to 23 pounds per month, which includes your shipment from Canada. Uh, you get four to six items, which includes a exclusive T-shirt each month, and it's all based on various video game franchises. Um, I know we've got a Legend of Zelda item this month, and I'm really looking forward to it. This is my favourite block that I receive each month, so I always look forward to opening this one. So, we'll see what we've got. Right. So, I've just done my um, horror block unboxing, which, if you've not watched, <coughs> if you've not seen that already, check that out. We received a pop vinyl figure in that. This time around, we've got another pop vinyl, and we have a Borderlands figure of Mad Moxie. Um, not a massive Borderlands fan, to be honest, so kind of a bit good, but don't really care for Borderlands. <coughs> this is a cool looking pop, though. Uh, gonna check that out. I'm getting a bit closer to zoom up on that. There we go. Love pop vinyl figures. I can't get enough of them at the minute. <laughs> Brilliant. Stick that down the side. Now we have a blind bag. <coughs> Assassin's Creed minis. Again, I'm not an Assassin's Creed fan, so a bit of a moot point for me. Ah, a similar style figure to what I've got with uh, this one. And there is a Doc Ock somewhere. I don't know where it's gone. So, ah, he's there. So it's a similar style, a uh, little figure for that, you get a little stand with it, you stick them on that. That's cool enough though. I'm we'll focusing on that. Sweet. Uh, ooh. So, learned a Zelda item. Uh, we have a Hyrule Multi-Tool. So, I think that is a bottle opener, screwdriver. Uh, does it do anything else or is that just it? I think it's just a bottle opener and a screwdriver. Uh, I have seen these around, uh, but I've never picked one up. Uh, also, what's a key ring? Um, but it's not something that really overly appeals, so I've never bothered it. But I do have, a, obviously, I have a lot of Zelda things, and I have a lot of little Zelda merchandise and bits and bobs, so this will go on display right along with those. <coughs> we have some badges. Uh, Battleborn, never even heard of Battleborn if I'm honest. Uh, so yeah, focus and check that one out. Is it going to focus on that? Probably not. But yeah, what else? Just a mouse mat. Oh sweet, I do like this. Um, we have another Zelda item. And we have a Zelda mouse mat. It's quite thick, quite durable. We had one previously before that was rather thin and flimsy, but this one is awesome. I do like that very much. And that is going to go alongside my other one, which I'm looking at now. It's a overworld map from Link to the Past. So, yeah. If I could wall mount that, I'd wall mount that, but I don't know how I'm going to wall mount that. Because it's quite heavy and obviously it's rubber backed, so I'll find a way. T-shirt! <coughs> ah, sad. Uh, Fallout 4 t-shirt. Oh, I say Fallout 4, a Fallout t-shirt. You don't know if you can really pick that up, but that is sort of in a luminous green. Fluorescent green. <coughs> Spoiler card say it glows in the dark. So yeah, glow in the dark. Fallout t-shirt. <laughs> Pretty cool. Quite like that. Uh, but, but, right, so a little quick recap with the card. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, in my horror block, I was in my horror block unboxing video, I was saying that Nerdblock is starting to do uh, phone cases. So as I said in that video, if you do subscribe to any of these nerd blocks, uh, pop along to your account and update your account information. Uh, there's a select few phones that you can put on there at the minute, but we're also gauging an interest to see what other phones are available. 
and uh, what other people have got and obviously they'll update that in time so obviously they can accommodate everyone um, yeah so they also have shoe size as well I received a pair of socks in a box previously so I'm assuming that's what that's for so yeah if you are subscribed to no block pop along sort that one out uh, recap card we had Borderlands Pop by the look of that you could have got one of those four um, as I say I'm not really fussed about <coughs> Borderlands so whichever I got I got whatever uh, and then obviously we had the Hyrule Multi-Tool the Assassin's Creed Minis Collectibles uh, exclusive Majora's Mask Mouse Mat exclusive Battle Bomb Buttons and the exclusive Fallout T-Shirt so all in all not a bad block not everything hits with me but obviously that's the thing with uh, subscription boxes mystery boxes not everything's going to hit but the most important thing is the quality of the items and the quality of items is always there with nerd blocks next month we have an item from Warcraft also it's set to feature four exclusives I'm focusing on that four exclusives whatever <coughs> Super Mario Brothers and Plants vs Zombies and more so thank you for watching this unboxing video if you enjoy this video give us a, a thumbs up if you're not subscribed yet subscribe now uh, items that I know I don't care for and don't appeal to me I have an eBay store I'll put a link in the description below so you can pop along there and check those out more than likely the Borderlands Funko Pop will end up on there um, probably the t-shirt as well maybe because I have like four subscriptions I get like four lots of t-shirts each month that's a lot of t-shirts when you work it out for the year so I only save select ones which I really 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 like um, yeah so thank you for watching and we'll see you again next time